So. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sonia, and today's video is going to be a makeup in a rush, just in time for back to school, back to work, back to life, whatever you've got going on, because the summer is almost over, and I'm so grateful because it's freaking hot here in California. I'm sweating to death. A little bit spicy, a little spicy, okay. But if you guys are interested in videos just like this, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you have not already joined my family, and let's get started. Okay, so to get started, I'm going to go ahead and prime my face. I'm using CoverGirl's True Blend Base Business. It's called Everyday Defense. This skin primer also has SPF 20. So I'm going to place this in the areas where I need the most help as far as this pore situation goes, which is gonna be my T-zone, my nose, and my cheeks. We gotta be quick about it, cause you know, we're running late. Next, I'm going to be using a foundation from e.l.f. This is their oil-free SPF 15 foundation. I'm going to apply it first with a brush, then blend it in with the sponge. Has it ever happened to you like when you're rushing, you start dropping things or freaking out a little bit more? Yeah, that happens to me all, all the time. Or I put my clothes on first and then get my makeup on my clothes. The worst is when like your mom is telling you hurry up and get your ass in the car. You know, that's the worst. I'm the mom now, so gotta tell myself that. I can't get over the fact that I look naked. Sorry about that. I just got makeup on my pants. <laughs> so I'm going to be taking this palette from L'Oreal Paris. This is their Concealing and Contour Kit number 220. The first shade I'm going to be using is this one here for concealing. And then I'm going to be using this shade here to contour. I'm just gonna be using my fingers cause <laughs> we're in a rush. And I'm gonna take my sponge again and blend that out. Then I'm gonna be taking a brush for my contour. Next, I'm going to be taking a powder, and this is from Burt's Bees. This is their mattifying powder foundation with bamboo, and I'm using the shade Sand. Please don't be too light, please don't be too light. Have you guys ever like packed your makeup, like just grabbed a bunch of stuff and put it in a bag and then jumped in the car and you just are like, Shit. This is not what I wanted to pack. I just grabbed whatever was closest to me. Yeah, that's happened to me so many times, or, I'm driving as fast as I can to work and I'm trying to do my lips, my eyes and everything. I end up putting eyeliner on my lips. Mess. Powder looks good. Okay, okay. Hurt me, okay. This is Honest Beauty's Dusk Reflection Luminizing Powder. This is one of my favorite color to use all over my face. It's really pretty. It's so pretty though, honestly. Honest. Lee. <laughs> Mom joke. I'm <laughs> just imagining crickets like no one's laughing. It's fine. Rough crowd. One of my new favorite things, and I might be like late AF to doing this, is using a bigger brush to do the highlighting. If you guys have not already followed me on Instagram, you don't know what the heck I am talking about, but if you are following me, you know, girl, I've been pretty like glowy lately and it's not because I'm pregnant with Jesus's baby. No, I've been using this new technique. I'm going to be using a powder from Wet n Wild and this is their Mega Glow Loose Highlighting Powder and this is in the shade I'm So Lit. So, oh. <laughs> I'm late. We're gonna be okay. <laughs> ah! Okay, all right. Oh! <laughs> My dogs were like, what the frick is going on in there? Biso, get away from my door, you freak. Oh my God, let's blend it out a little bit more. It's intense. I look like an alien. That's it, it's over. I'm going to area 51. Moving on to my eyebrows. I'm gonna be using this pencil here and it's from Burt's Bees. This is their brow pencil and I'm using the shade number 1610 Brunette. And it's got a spoolie brush on one end, pencil on the other. All right, next up we're gonna do this lemonade palette from Maybelline New York. So this is what the palette looks like. You have some crazy colors in there and you have some really soft, neutral colors. Now when you're in a rush, are you trying to do a cut crease? No. I'm gonna go ahead and use a shade called Sugar Coated and it's got some metallic in there so it's gonna give you a little bit of bling on your eyes. I'm just gonna go ahead and cover my entire lid up to the crease and make sure that I blend this out really, really, really well. 
so pretty and just blend it blend it make sure there's no harsh edges girl I remember I owned a black eyeshadow just one and I only had one brush and I didn't know anything about blending so I just walked around looking like someone punched me in the eye it was rough in the streets guys I'm gonna take a little bit of that underneath my eyes as well so I'm gonna curl my eyelashes this curler in particular is from Tarte Cosmetics and I got it in PR so this here is called the unlimited mascara from L'Oreal Paris and it looks like this it's like a little genie bottle don't do a mascara on the damn road and if you do do it at a red light and if you can't do it in the parking lot of your job please do not apply mascara like a gorilla like me don't do that okay learn from my mistakes okay lips any lips let's do cover girls lipsticks here and this is in the shade 960 and it comes in two pieces so one of them is the color and then this is like the top coat so I'm gonna go ahead and just use this color. It's one of those stain situations though, so you have to be careful. Then you have to give it like a minute for it to kind of dry. Okay, so now I'm going to put on the top coat. You can literally do this as you're like walking in to clock in, you know what I mean? Nailed it! That's it. Now you're naked to work because you forgot to put your clothes on. Just kidding. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, got a good laugh, and like always, thank you so much for watching and spending time with me on my channel. Don't forget to like, share, and also subscribe if you have not already joined my family, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!